Hello everybody and welcome to another Back to Basics 316 video. I am Brian, my ho your host. Today's verse is found in Ephesians 1.3. Ephesians 1.3. Ephesians is one of the four books that are in the New Testament that Paul wrote. He wrote several others, but Galatians, Ephesians, Philippians, Pop Ephesians, Colossians. Go eat popcorn is what I was told to get the order right. Anyway, Ephesians 1, 3. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us with every spiritual blessing in heavenly places in Christ. Ephesians 1, 3. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us with every spiritual blessing in heavenly places in Christ. Ephesians 1, 3. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us with every spiritual blessing in heavenly places in Christ. There's a lot in this verse. Some verses you can meditate on and, and every day you get something new out of it because they're new every morning. Great is his faithfulness. In this verse, we're, at, we're told to bless God and because for a reason, he's blessed us in every spiritual blessing. And there's times when I've gotten blessings at work. I don't know why. I don't know what happened. I've gotten blessings and presents from people when I wasn't expecting it. And it felt good. A little strange, but it felt good. God says he wants to bless you with everyone. So bless the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. So let's do that right now. I bless you, Father. I bless you, Father. I bless you, Father. Because you give us every spiritual blessing in Christ. I bless you, Father. In Jesus' name, amen. Let's go over this three times real slow. Ephesians 1, 3. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us with every spiritual blessing in heavenly places in Christ. Ephesians 1, 3. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us every spiritual blessing in the heavenly places in Christ. One more time. I'll do it a little slower this time. Ephesians 1, 3. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us with every spiritual blessing in the heavenly places in Christ. Let's have a word of prayer. Lord, I ask you to bless my friends and everybody watching the video that they will have me bless you, Lord, and bless you and remind them that you, you've been blessed with every spiritual blessing and have a place in Christ. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Well, thanks for listening, everybody. Thanks for listening. Uh, be sure to subscribe to my video and hit the like button because hitting the like button helps promote the video. Remember, Jesus Christ loves you. He died for you. He, he loves you, and he is coming soon. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye. Now, for those that want to, stick around, and we'll go over this verse several times slowly. Ephesians 1, 3. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us with every spiritual blessing in the heavenly places in Christ. Ephesians 1, 3. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us with every spiritual blessing in the heavenly places in Christ. Ephesians 1, 3. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us with every spiritual blessing in the heavenly places in Christ. One last time. Ephesians 1, 3. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us with every spiritual blessings in the heavenly places in Christ. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. Bye-bye for now. Bye-bye.